motion to reconvene regular meeting number 62 from December 11th, 2023. Second. Clerk, call the roll. Bankston, Barossa de Padilla, de Akauer, Dorrance, Favor, Green, Remy, Weish, President Harden. May I have a motion to adjourn regular meeting 62 from December 11th, 2023? So moved. Second. Clerk, call the roll. Bankston, Barossa de Padilla, de Akauer, Dorrance, Favor, Green, Remy, Weish, President Harden. Regular meeting number one of 2024 will now come to order. Please stand for the playing of the national anthem. Member Barossa de Padilla, will you lead us in the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Tonight, let us bow our heads in a moment of silent prayer and reflection so that we may ask for wisdom and the will to serve those in, the, in need to the best of our ability. Thank you. You may be seated. Our first order of business this evening is uh, the drawing of lots outlined in Columbus City Charter Section 4-1. It states that the city clerk shall divide the council districts into two classes by drawing lots. Lot A shall consist of five districts and the members from those districts shall serve a four-year term. Lot A will be represented by five white ping pong balls. Lot B shall consist of four districts, and the members from those districts shall serve a two-year term. Lot B will be represented by four orange ping pong balls. Candidates for those four districts shall stand for election to a four-year term in 2025. So we are going to um, draw the ping pong balls from a bag. I'm gonna ask the deputy clerk to hold the bag for me. We will draw by order of district one through nine. So we will start with number one. <laughs> okay, so a lot. My, using my cheat sheet, lot B, the two-year term for District 1, Christopher Weich. District, District 2, Nancy Day Alcower. So lot A, four-year term. District 3, Rob Dorans. Lot B, two-year term. District four, Emmanuel Remy. Lot B, two-year term. District five, Nick Bankston. Lot A, four-year term. District six, Melissa Green. Lot A, four-year term. District 7, Shayla Favor. Lot B, two-year term. District 8, Lourdes Barosa de Padilla. 
Lot A, four-year term, District 9, Shannon Harden. Lot A, four-year term. Thank you. Thank you. I now ask for the pleasure of council in electing a temporary president to preside for the purpose of electing a permanent president of city council. I move that Andrea Blevins be made temporary president for the purpose of electing a permanent president of Columbus City Council. Second. Clerk, call the roll. Bankston, Barossa de Padilla, de Akauer, Dorans, Favor, Green, Remy, Weish, President Harden. I now open the floor for nominations for permanent president of council. Uh, Madam Clerk uh, and temporary president, I would like to nominate uh, council member Harden as president of city council. I believe that he has served uh, this council with uh, dignity, with grace and integrity and believe that he will do so in this new historic and unprecedented change in our council. Are there any other nominations for president of city council? If not, the floor is closed for nominations. Clerk, call the roll by voice on the nomination of Council Member Hardin as permanent president of council. Bankston? Yes. Barossa de Padilla? Yes. De Akauer? Yes. Dorans? Yes. Favor? Yes. Green? Yes. Remy? Yes. Weish? Yes. Hardin? Yes. Congratulations. Thank you so much to my colleagues and look forward to serving uh, in our new two and four year terms uh, going forward. Uh, I now uh, open the floor for nominations for President Pro Tem of Columbus City Council. Thank you very much, Council President. It is my honor to, to uh, nominate that Council Member Rob Dorns be as President Pro Tem for Columbus City Council. Excited to uh, nominate my friend and certainly a strong leader for union leadership on council as we have now the most uh, strongest union council in the city of Columbus and so history. So we're excited to nominate him for president pro tem. Are there any other nominations for president pro tem of city council? The floor is closed for nominations. Clerk, please call the row for Rob Dorans as president pro tem of Columbus city council. Bankston. Yes. Barossa de Padilla. Yes. De Akauer? Yes. Dorans? Yes. Favor? Yes. Green? Yes. Remy? Yes. Weish? Yes. President Harden? Yes. Congratulations, President Pro Tem. I now move that Andrea Blevins be appointed as city clerk effective January 2nd, 2024. Is there a second on that? I second the motion. Councilmember Favor, second. Uh, I'm uh, clerk. Please call the roll. Bankston. Yes. Barossa de Padilla. Yes. De Akauer. Yes. Dorans. Yes. Favor. Yes. Green. Yes. Remy. Yes. Weish. Yes. President Harden. Yes. Congratulations, Madam Clerk. I now move that Ms. Deborah Clee be appointed as City Treasurer effective January second, twenty twenty four. Clerk, please call the roll. Bankston? Yes. Barossa de Padilla? Yes. De Akauer? Yes. Dorans? Yes. Favor? Yes. Green? Yes. Remy? Yes. Weish? Yes. President Harden? Yes. Congratulations, uh, Treasurer Klee. <laughs> May I have a motion to dispense with the reading of the journal? Second, first, so moved. Second. Clerk, please call the roll. Bankston, Barossa de Padilla, de Akauer, Dorans, Favor, Green, Remy, Weish, President Harden. Thank you, Madam Clerk. We have one ordinance on the agenda in the Rules and Policy Committee this evening. It's Ordinance 0096-2024. It's to amend sections 111.04 and 
111.14 of the Columbus City Code relating to the Standing Committees of Council to repeal existing sections 111.04 and 111.14 and to declare an emergency. Uh, this is our, uh, this ordinance is uh, in relation to our setting our new committees. Um, this year, uh, this council is historic in many different ways, uh, but one of those ways is um, reducing the number of committees from 21 down to 11. Uh, we believe that this will allow for more focus of, uh, and council priorities to be lifted up in those new committee assignments. And we're really excited about each committee and the leadership of each one of the council members as chair uh, and the co-chairs and all the work that we will do together. Are there any other questions or comments uh, on uh, ordinance 0096? Hearing none, I move for passage. Clerk, please call the roll. Banks, Tim, Barossa, Day Padilla, Day Akhauer, Dorns, Favor, Green, Remy, Weish, President Harden. Passed. If there is no other business coming before council, may I have a motion to adjourn? I apologize. It would be nice for everybody to know what those committees are. So, <laughs> Madam Clerk, would you please read the committees? Rules and Policy Committee, Council President Shannon Harden, Chair, Council President Pro Tem Rob Dorns, Vice Chair, all members serve. Finance and Governments, Governance Committee, Council Member Nick Bankston, Chair, Council President Pro Tem Rob Dorns, Vice Chair, all members serve. Zoning Committee, Council President Pro Tem Rob Dorns, Chair, Council President Shannon Harden, Vice Chair, all members serve. Workforce Education and Labor Committee, Council Member Rob Dorns, Chair, Council President Shannon Harden, Vice Chair, all members serve. Economic Development and Small Business Committee, Council Member Nick Bankston, Chair, Council Member Lourdes Barossa de Padilla, Vice Chair, all members serve. Housing, Homelessness, and Building Committee, Council Member Shayla Favor, Chair, Council Member Melissa Green, Vice Chair, all members serve. Public Safety and Criminal Justice Committee, Council Member Emmanuel Remy, Chair, Council Member Shayla Favor, Vice Chair, all members serve. Public Service and Transportation Committee, Council Member Lourdes Barosa de Padilla, Chair, Council Member Nancy de Akauer, Vice Chair, all members serve. Public Utilities and Sustainability Committee, Council Member Chris Weiss, Chair, Council Member Emmanuel Remy, Vice Chair, all members serve. Health, Human Services and Equity Committee, Council Member Melissa Green, Chair, Council Member Shayla Favor, Vice Chair, all members serve. Neighborhoods, Recreation and Parks Committee, Council Member Nancy Day Akauer, Chair, Council Member Chris Weiss, Vice Chair, all members serve. Thank you, Madam Clerk. I think I can speak for the council members or chairs of these committees that we look forward to working with the administration and our community stakeholders as we uh, dispense with the important business of the community of our city. Thank you, Madam Clerk. Now, if there are no other business coming before council, I move uh, to adjourn. Clerk, please. Thank you. Uh, Clerk, please call the roll. Bankston, Barossa de Padilla, de Akauer, Dorns, Favor, Green, Remy, Weish, President Harden. We stand adjourned.